I'm John Sterling. I'm Richard Price's editor, and uh, we're here to talk about The Whites, um, which Richard has written under the name Harry Brandt. Uh, years ago, I introduced you, as it happens, to uh, David Simon, creator of The Wire, mm -hmm. and as fans of the show know, uh, you wrote several episodes for it. Um, we had a really memorable first night together. Tell, yeah. them, tell the story of that ride. Well, we, 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 we three of us, we started on a pina coladas, and then you left, and David and I got a little sloppy, and the next day we swore it would never happen again, but... <laughs> no, I shouldn't tell. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, I know what you're talking about. Um, okay, that night, it was the night of the Rodney King verdict, yeah. and he had just finished Homicide, a year, uh, a year on the killing streets of Baltimore, and you were um, editing Clockers, and you thought, like, you two boys should play together, you know, like, you know, like a mom that brings, you know, two sulky kids into play a, a dance room, yeah. and you're just like, you know, this is Michael, you know, this. and so... And we, we just bonded, and immediately, because we, we write about the same stuff, we, you know, we have great sympathy for the same people. And from my window in lower Manhattan, you could see across the river, they were rioting in Jersey City, and you can sort of see right into Jersey City. So we, we had a play date. I, uh, I called a homicide cop in Jersey City that I, you know, was an inspiration for one of the characters in Clockers. He picked us up, and we were cruising the streets, with uh, Larry Mullane, this, this homicide, Hudson County homicide detective. And he was an old motorcycle cop originally. And a motorcycle cop had gotten uh, banged up because somebody laid a tripwire uh, during, during these uh, confunctions, conflagrations. And uh, he just bolted out of the car. He ran into the police precinct and he put... I can't remember if David got behind the wheel or I got behind the wheel. So we were in the cop car. Yep. And he said, um, all right, look, just drive. Anybody approaches, look mean, you know, and just, just stare him down and keep driving. And, and we, we were like Abbott and Costello. We were like, so these two tough guy riders, we, we, we I would, had the crap scared out of me. Um, I don't know about David. Um, he had been a police reporter, so. And I just remember the first time a guy started going to the car, we were both, ah, you know, the hair went up and it floored it. We probably killed three people. But that was our first play date. And, uh, you know, our moms keep getting us together, you know, even though we go to different high schools now. 